Hello everyone, and welcome to a Sharpie Puss production. I'm Sharpie Puss, and today I am going to be showing you the Road Redemption Alpha, which is basically uh, a rehash of the old Road Rash series, um, like for PlayStation 1, uh, Road Rash 3D, and normal Road Rash. I think it was on Sega as well and other stuff. Um, but anyway, yeah, this is the Alpha. It's very basic, but I just wanted to share this awesome fun with you. So, without further ado, let's get to it. Now, when I was growing up, I used to play Road Rash non-stop. I had like a, I think it was like a charity, like, three-game bundle. It had Broken Sword, Road Rash, and Mist in it. Oh, God, and it's just crashed. Would you look at that? Okay, let's try that again. Let's run as administrator as well, just to just to really give it a little boost. Okay, here we go. Try again. Boop, boop. Okay, yeah. So anyway, as I was saying, Road Rash is freaking awesome, and this is the alpha that I'm hoping to show you right now. Please work. Oh, it's got a thin uh, mouse keyboard. Start. Yes. Oh Jesus. Okay, I think I'm in. Okay, yeah. Um, yeah. Oh God, sorry. Right. Okay, I'm 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 with it now. So basically, this is Road Redemption. It's pretty basic, but it is so much fun. I have been playing it non. -st oh God, sorry, my thing just alt tabbed. What's going on? Oh my God, I'm upside down. <laughs> this is what to expect from an alpha. But there you go. Okay, uh, we're off. Off the track, oh my god, okay, this isn't the best way I should start showing you this game. Oh, what's going on? I can't get over the hill. Okay. Uh, so anyway, as I was saying, uh, Alpha is Alpha, let's restart that level. Can't be having that, that was just redonkulous, I'm sorry. Okay, so, let's try again. Here we go. This is Road Redemption. Road, yeah, Road Redemption. So, anyway... All it is, is you're on your little motorbike and you can smash people in the head. Oh, look at that, he's off the track. But yeah, basically, this is all Road Rash was. It was racing and it was freaking awesome fun. Boom, you're off. Oh, oh, boom and boom, goodbye. But yeah, this is it. Um, so at the moment it just throws you in levels, oh, bit by bit. Um, the, it's got eight levels in total, I think. This one is like the most basic, very easy, no traffic, AI is retarded, and yeah, it's pretty much it. But they've kept to the old Road Rash t traditions of, you know, there's nothing too over the top. It's just your basic, like, racing, fighting, and avoiding traffic. That's all Road Rash was, and that's what made it freaking awesome, because it's just like an arcade game, and, uh, yeah, they've done a good job because after Road Rash 3D, I don't think they ever bought it back. I think they did one after 3D actually. I can't remember. I think it was like an expansion sort of maybe. I can't remember. It's been too long. But yeah, I'll quickly speed through the first level so you can get to see the more um, intense versions. Like level 7 and 8 are freaking redonkulous. Uh, here we go. Finish line, first place, like that. I'm so good. But yeah, um, so that's the first level done. And there's a car crash as well, just to top it off. And yeah, if you look at the bottom left, it should say traffic flow, right lane only. So that's very, very easy. Later on, pay attention to that. Like at the moment, traffic in both lanes, and it's on like, uh, oh, one sec. It's on both sides of the road. That's pretty much it. Oh yeah. You can deflect uh, people's weapons, so if they're uh, sometimes you start without a weapon and you might need to steal other people's. Like for example, in old Road Rash, sometimes you didn't start with a weapon and you'd have to actually. Um, the only people who had weapons was the uh, police. So um, oh, look at that! Deflected it. Boom! Samurai sword is freaking o o overpowered because it's just so fast and. Uh, yeah, I've noticed on this level you just basically have to kill a certain amount of people. Like, see at the top left it says remaining one, so you boy, you are my one. Oh, almost. Shall I slow down for him? Yeah, there we go. Oh, 
sped up and break. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> Hit the car. There we go. And you're dead. And you as well. Oh, there we go. So yeah, uh, that's another way to complete the levels. But it's a pretty fun game, to be fair. I'm looking forward to it when it's more developed because at the moment it's just basically it chucks you in and you race and you know it gets a bit more difficult each time like normal flow traffic here difficulty normal so it's a bit harder see like the traffic's coming in both directions now so that adds a bit <laughs> like that guy who just got wiped out um and don't worry if you're saying oh why don't you crash matt oh i will trust me and i'm just planting c4 on people but you need to make sure you steer away from them otherwise they will literally explode in your face so you basically do that and then you just listen out for that explosion. Oh, no, he's, he's playing it cool. He don't want to be caught. Oh. So, yeah, there's a lot of nice, interesting weapons. Like, the C4 is just hilarious. Like, because basically, I can imagine in multiplayer when you're playing with your friends. Like, as soon as they plant a C4 on you, for example, they are just going to activate their nitro and try and get you as well. Because, like, you know just blow it up and right in your face sort of thing whereas see I've got no nitro so when I plant it on this guy he might be able to get me but oh god no but the car almost did oh god and again oh look at this alpha alpha physics just going hitting cars and nothing happening oh sounds like he had a bad time there but yeah um what else yeah or in old road rash what you did is um you'd make money through winning races and then you'd save up for you'd start off with like really crappy bikes and then you'd save up for like the super bikes and they'd be the only way to actually compete later on in the game and Jesus they were insane these super bikes they literally went at the speed <laughs> they went faster than the game could render the physics and like all the environment and everything basically you were going so fast that sometimes a car would render in front of you and you wouldn't have time to like move okay now we've got pipe bombs these are amazing so you got the rear, rear mirror you just lay a pipe bomb and you watch the rear mirror and hope that you hit someone so here we go oh almost oh sorry shit I was looking at <laughs> looking at my mirror there no that's not good you got to be careful when you've got these pipe bombs as well because uh, you don't have weapons oh I got someone there okay here we go oh dropped it too early Okay, cool thing is you can actually uh, get the traffic as well, so you can sometimes make the traffic crash into the uh, into the guys, which is pretty awesome. Okay, here we go. Gonna get him this time. There we go. Boom! Oh! oh no. Get away from me! Get away! Oh! That one's for you. No, he's coming back. What a bastard. Get away. Oh, he's forcing me off the road. Gonna get him now. Oh, nope. And you don't want to obviously time it too late, otherwise you will end up killing yourself as well. Which isn't... Oh, I think I've got him. There we go. He's down. 20 points. And Moolah. Yeah, so in the Alpha, there is no menu to buy upgrades for your bikes or anything like that. It's literally just, uh, you know, boom, yeah. It's just like you make the money and it shoves you in the next level, but it's very early alpha sort of thing. I think they're just testing it out to see what, like, how the system handles and all that sort of stuff. But, yeah, so far so good. I really am looking forward to this game. You can grab it on Steam <laughs> for uh, 33 euros but or whatever, but don't do that. Um, oh, God, because it's not worth it at the moment, but... Later on where it progresses, I'll be doing like other reviews and stuff, and then uh, you can take a look if you fancy it. Um, so yeah, this is crazy mode. So the cars will be coming in the the lanes that they shouldn't be, like that. Oh god! And they will crash into other cars and create these amazing pile-ups, which sometimes are just freaking amazing. I defeated Paul Finch, look at that. Okay, here we go. So yeah, like, I can just imagine, like, you know, sitting on a couch, four player, playing this all with uh, controls, like, you need a gamepad, I think. I mean, you can pay it, I'm playing it on keyboard mouse at the moment, it's absolutely fine, they've done a good job, it's not like a 
they designed it for uh, console or anything like that, but uh, I'll give it a go with the controller and see what it's like. It should be fine because it's uh, Road Rash was always a, uh, a console designed game sort of thing. Oh god. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, what else? Whoops. Um, sorry. Yeah, there we go. So, yeah, there's not not much else to it at the moment. This is this is the game sort of thing. So if you like the look, whoa, there, there we go. There's the first crash, and there goes my samurai sword as well. Doing first place, that we're grand. So yeah, um, like I don't know. I I hope that they don't make it too crazy with all this, like the crashes and stuff. Because like in the old Road Rush, it was crazy enough just through the traffic even standing still like you go through some levels which would be uh, like peninsulas sort of thing and um, they'd, they'd just be you know oh god oh god get away <laughs> there'd be um there'd just be like heaps of traffic stuck in traffic jams and you'd have to line yourself up perfectly to just get through it all and that is you know that was a challenge like really big time because you were going so fast sometimes. Oh god, no! Um, so yeah, it was... Uh, but I mean, at the moment, you know, as long as they don't go too over the top and that these traffic modes, uh, like where they're crashing into each other, is maybe just... It can happen, but it's not as crazy, like in the campaign or something, maybe... Or just have party modes, that would be great, where you can activate those things. For like when you're playing with friends, you just want a really crazy multiplayer match or something. But, um, yeah, the campaign in Road Rush, it was always sort of, it started off very basic, and then as you went on, like, the levels would get harder, there'd be, like, more tight corners, and, like, uh, just, just things like that, that, oh, God, um, oh, God, oh, get away, oh, no, double explosion, look at that, <laughs> oh, that bounce, oh, there goes the place, Let's see if we can plant one on him. And boom, baby! I think that's it. That's all we need to complete the level. So they have learned their lesson, guys. Oh. So that is that level done. But no, it's a nice game. Like I'm looking forward to it when it's got a whole menu system and you do have to save up your cash to, you know, buy upgrades. Now this is what I'm talking about. This is freaking redonkulous. This is insane. Oh god. So this is fun. <laughs> car mounting another car there as well and there um, but yeah this is like the kind of thing you'd expect for party mode oh god look at that there we go but uh, it's raining cars guys it is literally raining cars and I don't know exactly why it's raining cars but I quite like it it's fun um, gonna, oh, oh cool right on the corner thought that bad um, so the idea of this one is basically just to survive to the end. Like I'm guessing this could be just like oh just a bonus mode or something. Like I don't know, or party mode. But um, I mean, it's showing what the physics are like and stuff, which is good because it's not well. Like okay, well, apart from that car which was doing like freaking 90 degree turns there. But oh man, oh! Sorry, try to concentrate, try to move. Oh god. Oh! Ah! Whoa! Man. Okay. Crap! Oh no. Oh, move. Oh dear. Um. So yeah, uh. There we go. Right, there we go. Oh god, right in that car. Look at that. Bang, boom, slide. Don't, don't, no, that was too close, too close! Oh no! Off the cliff. Ah. Oh yeah, that was another thing in Road Rush. When you did use to fall off your bike, you had to run back to your bike as well. Um, and that was a piss take, because sometimes when you got the super bikes and you were going, you know, like, freaking ruffle miles an hour down the highway, and you hit, like, I don't know, there was, like, rocks 
and stuff you could hit as well and or a telegraph pole and then you'd literally go sliding which felt for like about like a mile and a half sort of thing and then you'd have to run all the way back to your bike and in that time i think there was there was a lot of races in that game as well like probably about 30 or something so you can imagine like one muck up and that was it i mean they crashed as well but not very much there was always one guy who was like you know the pro sort of racer who never crashed and this mode this is quite interesting this is uh cars will home into you um like as you can see they're proper freaking driving to try and hit me um now this is fun because you can drive like in between the cars like this and then the ones behind you like you can just you, cause like oh god huge pile up like whoa look at that bounce like this which will own the other players behind you sort of thing but um i mean they're pretty easy to dodge when they're just coming like well normally but like with the fog obviously i guess on some maps that will get thicker and stuff like that but like watch this whoa there we go so yeah it's always jesus Oh man, no! Oh look, look at that. Good old alpha game physics there. Oh, and that, that hit me off, but the other one didn't. Blimey. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, we're fourth. Come on, we need to get the, get the places back here. Oh man! Oh, God, I love alpha physics. Um, so yeah, here we go. Let's try and see if we can get some places back here. But no, like, um, it's a fun game. I can see myself playing a lot of this, like, when it's got a proper, you know, campaign mission. I hope they make it, like, a really sort of challenging campaign. Like, uh, maybe not as over the top as this currently is. But, uh, oh, yeah, I don't think that's good enough to pass. I think we need second or first. So I might have to do that one again. Um, but yeah, like, you know, if they can... Here we go. Get some early get ahead of these poppadoms. Whoop. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Like, I'd like a legit campaign that's like normal traffic with your occasional crash and stuff like that and then party modes and that'd be awesome. Uh, oh, there we go. Woo that was close. Oh, he got woke out. But I mean, it's a nice looking game as well. Like, it looks pretty awesome. Like, you know, it's not it's not amazing, but it's uh, it's all you need. Like, as long it, you know, there's those games where they'll focus on graphics so much and the gameplay will be crap, but you can tell they've really put the stuff into the gameplay. Like, the controls and everything feel perfect. Like, whoa! As you would expect, like, perfect amount of movement from leaning left to right and everything, and oh god, oh god! <laughs> bouncy, bouncy. Lost, like, four places. Oh, that's like a move. Right, come on. Gotta bring this back. Turbo. Turbo up there, and hope that there's no one coming around this corner. Uh, there is. Oh, no. That was lucky. Ooh. Okay. Can't see. Okay. Should have another weapon. The shovel's too slow. Oh, <laughs> second, nice. I think that's it. That'll count. Literally got away with that. Oh, there we go. Whee! <laughs> uh, I think that's it. Yeah, that is the alpha done, guys. So they're the eight levels you get at the moment. As I said, like you know, I backed this game for about uh, a fiver back, like half a year ago. So at the moment, it is worth a fiver for sure. But you can't buy it for a fiver anymore because that was on Kickstarter. So uh, the only way I think is Steam Greenlight or whatever it's called. But I wouldn't really recommend spending 33 euro on it at the moment because that's too much. But anyway, there you go. Hope you enjoyed. Um, like and comment this video and all that other random stuff that I meant to say. And have a good evening, morning. Have a nice morning, evening, good night, afternoon, hello, yes, goodbye. Thank you, I'm Sharpie Puss. Thank you.